Now for many Bryan College Station health patients, driving 70 miles to the nearest doctor is not ideal. And now KXH News reporter Tashara Parker got an exclusive look inside one hospital in College Station. She shows us how this facility is making sure patients no longer have to worry about how far they need to travel. Instead, just set an appointment. Walking into a behavioral health facility is sometimes the hardest step to take and even more difficult when the nearest hospital is more than 70 miles away. For so long, patients were having to go outside the Brazos Valley to get care for psychiatric needs. And not only is that hard for patients and continuity of care and such, but it's hard on the families as well. Tracy Ayers is a nurse at the Rock Prairie Behavioral Health Center. She's had to deal with her own family member being admitted to psychiatric inpatient care. She understands the importance of having a hospital nearby. We had to go outside the Brazos Valley about two hours or so, and um, I wasn't able to visit my loved one, and um, things were very challenging. It felt very distant um, and really added to the stress. This was all before the Rock Prairie Behavioral Health Center opened in College Station. With 55,000 square feet and 72 beds, it's the first of its kind in the BCS in nearly 17 years. You can come here for a free assessment at any time and be able to get clarification on what your needs are. So it provides a lot of hope for people that we have a local resource to be able to handle psychiatric emergencies. Now this hallway right behind me will be home to their new child and adolescent wing. It's slated to open sometime this fall. Watching a loved one have to go through that um, and knowing that I can be a part of giving excellent care and walking the patient through that crisis and walking the family through that crisis and seeing them come out on the other side. Having that personal experience is just one of the reasons why Tracy believes the Rock Prairie Behavioral Health Center is filling the gap of psychiatric care one patient at a time. In College Station, Tashara Parker, KX HD News. Now the facility is open 24 hours, seven days a week, and anyone is welcome to stop by for a free assessment at any time of the day. Currently, they are only able to accept adult patients. However, the child and geriatric facilities should open later this year.